Hey everybody, we're here in Sylvania at Kyoto Ka, where I'm here with Chef Sung and Master Chef Joe. But first, before we get started, I wanted to thank Jason for nominating Kyoto Ka. So thanks for the nomination, Jason. And we're going back into the sushi bar to make some of that great sushi. Let's go. All right, what are we going to be starting off with first? Okay, this is going to this is calling salmon rose. Oh, salmon rose. Yes. I like the sound of it. Right, it's okay. kind of appetizer. We with a um, scallop, scallop and a salmon around it. Right now he's cutting the fresh salmon. Wow. Four pieces so that you can make it like a rose. Okay. But we're gonna broil it this time, so it's not like... A... So it's all cooked. So for those of you who aren't too into the raw fish thing, then this is perfect for you because it's actually cooked, right? Yes, yes it all is. Right. Well, that's perfect. So what's next? Okay, a little bit, sweet sauce, spicy crab. Spicy crab? crab. Mm -hmm. So this is going to be a spicy dish? Yes. Yes. Not it's a little bit spicy, spicy it's a little but... little kick to yes, it, nothing yes. too outrageous. Right. How so long is that going to be in there? This will take about, about, about 30 seconds okay. to cook it. So while that's cooking, I wanted to talk about a little bit, you guys are actually opening up a new restaurant, right? right. at downtown Toledo. Downtown Toledo? At Toledo Edison's building. We'll be on the first floor. That's exciting. <laughs> How long have you guys been here in Sylvania? We've been here about eight years so far. So now the decoration. Decoration with a sweet sauce. Ooh. This is three different type of flying fish roll. Flying fish roll, what's the green one? Green one is a flying fish roll with a wasabi. Um, ah, wasabi mixed into yes. the flying fish roll. And then the dark one? Black, black flying fish roll. Black yeah. flying fish roll. Yes. Yeah. Here we have our beautiful rose. Great job, Master Chef Joe. <laughs> We're gonna put this aside right now and what are we making next, Joe? Yeah, Hawaiian volcano. A Hawaiian volcano. Okay, so we're gonna make a roll uh, with a spiced tuna inside. Okay. And on top, we're gonna put some uh, red snapper on, fresh red snapper on top. Looks good. Yep. And then... Okay, so now we have right here, this is just a spicy tuna roll. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we're gonna lay the snapper on top. Mm -hmm. Okay, a flaming skillet. Yes. So, wow. Wait, this one... now I have an mm -hmm. idea why it's yeah. called the volcano. Yeah. <laughs> Sea salt, 50% alcohol. Yeah. You don't mess around, do you? <laughs> <laughs> okay, here it goes. Now I know why it's yeah. called the Hawaiian volcano. Okay. All right, well now that the flame has died down, it's finally safe to eat. Mm -hmm. Here it goes. Mm. <laughs> well done, Chef Joe. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Very good. This is the most beautiful rose that mm. any man has ever given to me, so okay. <laughs> props to you guys. Okay. <laughs> it's absolutely perfect. Right. Thank you. <laughs> and that's just the appetizer. Yeah. So come down to Kyoto Ka and say hello to Chef Sung and Chef Joe, Master Chef Joe. Don't forget. <laughs> Thanks guys so much for having me. It was All a lot right. of fun. Thank you. And don't forget to visit my Facebook page to vote for your favorite local dishes for Life Tastes Better here.